Hello, Michael Diamond, and you're watching Muscle Central. Okay, it looks like the 212 competitors are invading the Open Division. Now, we've had William Bonac and now Hadi Chupan, who both came from the 212s, and they're uh, top-level Open Olympia competitors. We expect to see when James Flex Lewis finally steps on stage on the open uh, division to do some pretty amazing things. Uh, and most recently, Sean Florida wins an open show, which qualifies him for both the 212 and the open Olympia. And now, uh, Angel Calderon wins the Big Man Pro. Uh, he just recently qualified for the, requalified for the 212 Olympia. He's competed in the, in the Olympia in the past. He's just requalified for the, uh, 212 and he's now qualified for the Open. Uh, the question's been, are they going to allow the, the competitors that they choose to, to compete in both divisions? Uh, in the recent past with Hadi Chupan, we saw they wouldn't allow it. They made, they made him make a decision on which, uh, to, the, which to compete in. Chose the open. Now, uh, maybe uh, things will be a little different now. Maybe they'll be a little more open to the idea, which uh, would be great. But that's another top, another video in and itself. The question is now... Since we've seen these big guys, these little guys knock off the big guys in the open division by bringing in great, a uh, complete package, total package, with great conditioning, is that going to make the guys in the open division turn it up a notch? And say, hey, listen, maybe we better start coming in in a little better conditioning. Because for the most part, there's only a, a very small hand few that do bring the conditioning pretty much all the time. Are they going to start saying, well, maybe we better start stepping it up a notch with the conditioning because if we don't these smaller guys are gonna beat us uh, I don't know if the 212s are gonna be able to compete in both uh, divisions in the Olympia but just to Thought, just to put the thought in the head of the open competitors that size is not going to be the tell-all thing with, with making a decision on who's, gonna, who's winning. If the little guy comes, the smaller guy comes in with a total package and nails the conditioning, we're going to have a problem. It's the old adage, uh, all things cons uh, being equal, the bigger guy will generally win. The problem is the conditioning aspect of it. And a lot of times they're coming in short. Maybe seeing this happen will put them more on the ball and really push the conditioning a little better. We're going to see, uh, instead of the 
the the the mind the few on stage with. The conditioning, we'll see the majority on stage with the conditioning. All right, let me know what you think about this video. If you liked it, give it a thumbs up. Please share and by all means subscribe. Do not forget to hit that notification bell. This way, every time I put up a new video, you will be notified. Also, if you go to the links, you'll find, um, if you go to the description box, you will find some links. One is to the Facebook Muscle Central page. You can go there, DM me any questions. I'd be happy to answer them. Also, you find a link to Species Nutrition, Mr. Potts Protein. Click on both links, go to both websites, and check out all their great products. Once again, this is Michael Diamond. I'd like to thank you for watching Muscle Central.